Hello everybody, hope this finds you well. This video is going to walk you through how to complete the SABERS risk screener assessment for your students in your homeroom classroom. Once we're inside of FastBridge, we'll go over to the role selector. You'll make sure that you select your particular account. Click go. Then we'll come over to the screening tab and then along the left hand side we'll come down and find SABERS. We'll click on this and we'll find our particular grade level. If you're at the elementary and you have a single group based home room, you'll see one grade level here. If you're at the 712 building, you'll see that you will have three student or three groups here for the different grade levels in your particular home room. So we'll go ahead and click on this. And then at this point, you'll see a list of your students and you'll see this gauge appearing in the fall because we're in the fall screener window. We're in the sandbox right now, so it's locked into the spring, but it allows us to look at this without seeing any actual real student data. So at this point, when we're ready to begin the assessment, we would go ahead and click this gauge. It says click to assess when we hover over it. We'll find the directions. You can read through those. You're going to find where you can leave a particular note about the student, and then you're going to find as you go through the social, social academic an emotional risk or behavior risk screener is what SABER stands for. You're going to see that this breaks down into the three domains of social behavior, academic behavior, and emotional behavior. As we go through, you're going to spend just a few moments thinking about your interactions with the student up to this point in time, and you're going to rate if you see that particular behavior never, sometimes, often, or almost always. When you finish, you're going to leave a note if you so choose and then you'll hit submit either at the top or at the bottom and then you'll see the, be able to see the score. If you need to back out of it, simply hit cancel and when you're finished you'll see the individual composite scores for the students listed here. If you have any questions, please let us know.